Hi folks, in this tutorial we'll uh, implement a simple example to get start started with PrimeNG. So what is PrimeNG? PrimeNG is a collection of rich UI components for Angular 2. It is a sibling of popular uh, framework JSF Faces components or Prime Faces. What Prime Faces does is it provides us with widgets which can be used directly in our applications. PrimeNG pr uh, provides us a similar feature for Angular 2. It provides us with widgets like tables etc which can be directly used our, in our application. This helps developers to save time and also we can create awesome applications in no time. To begin an example, we'll first have to install Node.js. Go to the Node.js website and click, click here on uh, download for Windows. This is a .exe file. So install this st uh, startup. I have already installed it. So you can install it on your machine. Next we'll make use of the quick start example provided by PrimeNG. So just go to Google and just start PrimeNG quick start. So this is an example which is there in GitHub. From here download the zip file. So once the zip file has been downloaded extract it to any location that you want. I'll be extracting it in C prime ng folder. Next start the command prompt. Here we'll go to the folder where we have extracted the prime ng uh, quick master folder. So in my case it is prime ng and this is a quick start folder. First we'll have to install the node.js so for this the command is npm install. So we have successfully installed npm. After it has been installed next we'll start the application for that we'll use the command npm start. So here as you can see the application it has been started. It runs on the port localhost colon 3000. So this is the application that is getting run. If you'll go to PrimeMG, PrimeMG uh, Quick Start Master. In the app folder, here these are the resources uh, that have been made available. In the cast folder, the different TypeScript files, the TS files which are used by Angular 2 have been made available for us. What this application does is, it provides the various uh, features of the car. Also, if we click on it, we can change the details here. Well, in the PrimeMG Quick Start Master. So here, PrimeMG has provided us with a table widget, which can be used directly in our application. Using this widget, uh, records can be modified new uh, details uh, or a new records can be added uh, and uh, this uh, we don't have to develop it from scratch this widget will be just like a plugin which can be directly used in our application so the application development time it also decreases so i hope you have understood this quick start tutorial in the next tutorial we'll create our own uh, typescript files uh, for employee details and uh, we'll uh, see how we can do this thanks